Welcome with another video. Today I'm here at about 8:30 a.m. It's almost 8:32. So I'm just uh, I've just I reached here at about 8:25, and I'm now sitting outside my research part three lab because it's the lab hours till 11 o'clock. I have to stay with my students, so I'm waiting for my students to reach the lab. Still, they are coming. A uh, few of them have just reached, and I'm waiting for them. The others, to, so I'm just sitting on the chair outside the lab you can see me the long corridors they are still empty and they are nowhere though they are supposed to come and uh, reach the lab at about 8 30. so let's see today i have uh, prepared made my students learn about how to prepare uh, shift base so they are now going to have go, prepare this shift base called benzalidine aniline and this is how I've explained them today how to prepare benzalidine aniline and how they are going to detect they are going to basically they are going to form our shift base so I explain them how they are going to make a shift base within a period of 30 minutes time given recommended time is 30 minutes and after that they are going to get the product and they are going to get the product in the uh, this oily globules will be form which will then crystallize and they, they will cool it down in some uh, beaker or something and then they are, these will be these will crystallize to and they will get the product right the crude product or the ship base and i explained them that this group is the azomethan group it confirms the formation of an uh, ship base and how they are going to find out that whether this group is present they need to go through uh, i mean your after the whole process the whole reaction process they need to go through a technique called ftir uh, spectroscopy that is fourier transform infrared spectroscopy and in after recording the melting point they are going to after the recrystallization and the melting point they are going to go for this technique that is FTIR and with the help of this FTIR they can detect the peak at about uh, around 1600 which can for 1625 or uh, I've written also here 1625 to something 1690 which I just remembered uh, and that peak confirms the formation of this um, group called azomethine and that that all confirms the presence of a shape base so this i have explained today to my students uh, for this part three and msc previous and they are working right now in the lab i can show you how they are doing it these are the boys they are doing it so you have learned what are you doing you're washing ma'am uh, currently uh, we are just waiting for the girls to give us the test tube that uh, it's specific for the so benzylidine. come and stand with them St come to and stand together so that you can easily do so what you are doing girls they are preparing now they, this is because they have to perform the experiment in the china dish the, it has this has been recommended that an evaporating dish this is called an evaporating dish or a china dish so this is how they are doing right now these are the this is the group which is doing right now mr Irfan is there and he's very much helpful he's my lab assistant a very senior lab assistant he's helping them as i've guided them how to do it so they are doing it the flame is on now be careful girls flame could load load your flames girls have are doing some mixing here also in the fume hood they are also mixing some few things now they are doing the process you can see the reaction going on the, this is the water bath they are prepared preparing now the water bath is about to be prepared as the water starts boiling then they are going to start the reaction So what are you people mixing? Ma'am, we are taking the solutions for okay. our experiment. Which, 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 which is this? What is this? This is this? Aniline, show, aniline, aniline. show me. Okay, good. It's in a good state. Okay. Yes, thank That's you. great. So uh, uh, now my students are working and they are doing their work and I'm very happy that they are doing their work. You can see them and they are doing whereas the other groups, there is no other group there. Only my students have uh, are here today and they are doing their work. You can see the other groups. There is no one on the other side. So it's only the organic chemistry. This group, my class, my group who is 
performing this experiment today and they are today present here and they are performing their work and I'm very happy for that. So as I've just mentioned that I have explained the whole experimental process to my students now they are preparing a ship base which I have explained so um, I told them all the steps which they are supposed to take when they are preparing the ship base because it takes almost 30 minutes to be uh, you know formed the presence of uh, azomethane group it confirms the presence of formation of the compound which I just explained to, to them and they are doing it and I'm very happy that they are doing this is because they are the only students who are there and they are only my students Dr. Moina's students who are working in the lab the rest of the lab is all empty nobody's there so I'm very happy that they are working and I am I mean they just made my day because uh, I just came here for them so right now I'm standing outside my lab this is the lab right and the, my students are working inside because uh, it becomes difficult to breathe inside uh, it's uh, full of chemicals and uh, I mean I'm scared because uh, you know they are all carcinogenic they can uh, damage us so I'm out standing outside for a while and then I will go again inside to look what they are doing to monitor them um, and to see what they are up to as they are preparing uh, a shift base today so I'm very happy that my students are preparing a shift base today so my students are working right now you can see them the boys I can show you they are doing their work they are now preparing the water bath because the, ex the reaction will go on with this water bath They are doing it and I'm happy that they are doing it. So that's it. The other water bath is there. So I'm now sitting back to my chair because uh, my students are working and I please take your register from here. Apna register ledger. I don't need it anymore. So my students are working there, you can see them, they are working there, they are working over there, I'm happy that they are trying and again and again. So now you can see my students, they are working with great concentration and with their full passion and their full involvement and I'm very happy that they are doing. Good luck girls. Thank you Mary. And the boys, they are doing it separately. So let me see. Don't drop now, okay? okay. Mm, great. I can show your faces, no problem. Okay, na? Aap log ki khair hai. Aap log ki khair hai. Koi farak nahi padta. Yes, that's it. Great. I appreciate those who work hard and those who are interested. You. And inshallah, you will get the fruit of your hard work. That's for sure. This is a small storage area where our glasswares, our whole chemicals and different things are placed here. You can see here and this is a room all, or you can say a storeroom for chemicals, for storing chemicals and for different, I mean, reagents you can see here. We can see lots of things that are here and this, this is an old cupboard. These are again the acids, right? Dilute hydrochloric acid. I can read few labels and ferrous sulfate and sodium bicarbonate and nitric acid is still there. Good. We need nitric acid in many experiments for nitrogen reactions. That's great. I'm not going to want to, sh I mean, um, show you the person behind all this hard, I mean, this experimentation. I mean, behind the scenes, there are people who are working and who are helping us a lot. We are the teachers. We only guide. We only explain the experiment. But these are the actually persons who are, um, I mean, uh, the actual workers uh, behind all this, the, I mean, the fruits we are eating. So this is Mr. Irfan. He's with me. Mr. Irfan is with me. And he's been with me since last, I mean, uh, last 25 years, 
पच्चीस साल तो हो गए होंगे ना आपको भी पच्चीस साल से ज़्यादा इनको हो गए हैं मेरे साथ यहाँ पर और हम यहाँ पर दोनों मिलकर एक टीम की तरह यहाँ पर काम किया है हमेशा से और ज़्यादातर थर्ड ईयर की लैब के अंदर ये होते हैं आपका कैसा रहा है यहाँ पर टाइम अच्छा गुजरा है अच्छा गुजरा है और मैडम भी जो जितना काउन हो सकता है मैडम करती है इनके साथ हम रोज सुबह सवा आठ बजे तक आठ बीस तक हम पहुंच जाते पहुंच जाते हैं और हम रोज मिलते हैं हम रोज मिल सबसे अच्छी बात यह कि हमारी मुलाकात रोज यहीं पर होती है एंड वी फील वेरी हैप्पी कि हम एक दूसरे को देख खुश होते हैं इनक्रेज करते हैं कि भाई चलो हम टाइम पर आ रहे हैं और हम टाइम पर अपना काम कर रहे हैं एंड माशा अरफान हमेशा अपनी जगह पर होते हैं और काम करते हैं एंड आई एम वेरी हैप्पी फॉर देट के जो भी केमिकल्स वट एवर थिंग्स वी आर नीरिंग आई मीन आई जस्ट सिंपली आई एम नॉट वर्ड कि वो चीज़ नहीं होगी बिकॉज आई नो दैट ही इज़ वेरी रिस्पॉन्सिबल और टाइम के साथ इन सब इंसान रिस्पॉन्सिबल हो जाते हैं सो मिस्टर इरफान इज ऑल्सो वन ऑफ दैम सो आई एम वेरी थैंकफुल टू मिस्टर इरफान थैंक यू सो मच इरफान थैंक यू सो मच सो नाउ आई एम टायर्ड एंड आई एम नाउ गोइंग बैक टू माई लैब फॉर अ वाइल बिकॉज इट्स वेरी इट्स बीन सिंस ऑलमोस्ट एन आवर आई एम हेयर सो नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू लीव Uh, for a while, I will come back again when you will get the crystals. Just let me know, okay? So I will would like to see the crystals. I will come because it's there. It's very you know smelly and I can't stand here. I can't breathe. I'm having breathing problem now, so I'm going out from this lab, okay? So sh I will definitely show the results. Get the pictures of them, okay? And or just call me. So I'm out of my lab now, and I am now. heading towards my office because it's been so i'm totally breathless because of uh, the pungent smell of benzaldehyde it simply irritated me a lot i'm i'm almost having breathing problem right now so see you again with something new something more interesting and exciting i'm, I'm heading towards my office you can see the whole chemistry it's all almost empty today i don't know why it's empty it's because of i think bara rabi level 12th bara rabi level is tomorrow so maybe it's because of that their students are a bit little bit less i can't see much students so this was today's video about the experimental work which i just showed you my students and the results definitely they are going to come up with i will show share that also wanted to show you my face i have inhaled so much of the benzyl dh that i am all tears and you can see my face and uh, i mean i am totally i was breathless there because the fume hood was not perhaps working the way it's supposed to work so i mean it's tough to be an organic chemist that's for sure still i'm there alhamdulillah